guys, it's Amy and today I have two little reveals for you and it is my new to me pochette, mini pochette and this Gucci card case from their new leather. Uh, this is the Gigi leather. Someone on YouTube, they made a review of their card case. It's the exact same size but in a different leather. Uh, so I was definitely intrigued because I love a good leather piece. As you all know, I'm moving on towards more, you know, full leather items and this is just perfect because this is their GG leather and just make sure when you go if you're interested in this item, they actually have two very similar GG leather. One is from their old collection and this is from their new collection. The old collection has a much softer, already almost like the look is only almost already broken in whereas this one is super stiff and it's quite a bit thicker and the interior is actually also lined with full leather which is great it has three compartments as you can see i've already started using it in fact i made sure to stuff it the moment i got it and the leather became a little bit softer already so i think if i had gotten the old version from last year's collection it will be like super soft which I would still have liked that. I think this will be super durable. I always talk about, you know, items that you have glazing to contend with. So this one does definitely have glazing, but it feels very sturdy and it feels thicker. So I don't think it would be a problem. And plus, even if it was coming off, I don't foresee it doing anytime soon. I would think that maybe in like you know, quite a few years and for quite a lot longer wear, it would maybe come off. But even if it does, I'm not too, too worried because for any leather items, they don't just crack on themselves. They usually with more, with more use, they actually soften up and they will be less prone to cracking actually. Unlike um, coated canvas, the more you use them, the more they actually harden because they dry up over time. Uh, and unless you take very good care of them, they might crack in the future. So this is how it looks like with a really, really full sort of wallet. These are all the things that I have in my actual long wallet. And as you can see, I fold my cash in half, stick it in the middle, and it fits perfectly. So like I said, this item is very, very durable. I can tell you that just by doing this, I can feel like the two leather like the interior and the outside leather makes a very nicely padded sort of protection for all the cards inside not that the cards really need protection to begin with but um and it's all lined with very luxurious very thick leather inside as well on the zipper here on the inside it actually says gucci right there it's very hard to see, but it does say Gucci. On the inside here, on one side, it says Gucci, made in Italy, and it has some sort of serial number there. At first, this leather felt a lot stiffer, but as you can see now, it has softened up, but it still keeps its structure. It's still quite nicely, um, it hasn't softened up, but it's not as stiff as the beginning, and so, even with closing it, it's so much easier now. So for those of you who might consider this wallet but are afraid of how stiff it is, especially when you check it out in person, don't be because literally after the first day or second day, especially if you fill it up and you open it and close it enough, it will soften up and it becomes such a dream to use it and to have. This is going to be such a great item to take with you on a daily basis and even to travel with. One of the main advantage that I really like about this one is that if you notice the gussets, they actually end here, but the cards, they fit right in between the smallest part of the gusset. It is a little bit bigger than the Chanel one. I think the Chanel one is just a bit smaller, but I think that this size is actually perfect because your cards actually don't end up getting stuck in the gussets. The length is about 12 centimeters from the leather here to the leather here and then the height of it is about seven and a half centimeters i do have mine stuffed so it might not appear as long my husband doesn't have as many cards as me so his might appear maybe half a centimeters longer mine is quite stuffed so right now the actual width of it is 2.75 centimeters but um, if you don't have as many things as me inside then i think 
you will have a much lighter and smaller, not as puffy wallet. But I have six cards here in one side with three of these smaller little um, rewards card here and then I have five cards here in the middle I have um, four notes plus a bunch of paper cards don't forget to like this video and subscribe to this channel if you've enjoyed this video and I will talk to you again very soon bye it's really just a little pouch to store the things that you normally would reach for but not all the time but it's just 